All right, welcome back, y'all. This is uh, Scott with uh, Scared City Productions. And as always, I've got Tony sitting here right beside me. Um, you know, we do a lot of unboxings. We do a lot of uh, things on, on this channel. Uh, I actually got, <coughs> uh, got told about this box. You got told. I got told. You got told. I did. Something. Um by our buddy uh, from the Variety Show Uncut, uh, Darren. Um, I believe he told me that... About it. Yeah, about the box, but I, I believe it has like uh, maybe Five Nights of Freddy stuff in it. I'm not I'm not really sure. Not the, don't know exactly what all is in it. Um, but for the price point, I, I really couldn't complain. Uh, it says it has $30 of value for $9.99. Uh, I do know that it's uh, from, from uh, Funko, um, so we're going to kind of get into this uh, real quick because we're really, we're not really pop uh, guys, so more than likely I'll end up selling all this stuff. Um, but I thought it would be neat because, you know, Five Nights at Freddy is kind of a, a horror related, you know, it's, it's a video game. I know it's kind of horror for kids. Um, but... Uh, Plus the, you, plus the figures are pretty cool. Yeah, why don't you pop that open real quick. And while he's cutting that, uh, if you haven't already subscribed uh, to the channel, uh, please... Uh, are you good? I'm just cutting off. That's nasty. Mm. But, uh... If Hilt you have, deep. Her, you're a pervert. If, uh, if you're you haven't pervert. Uh, already subscribed, you know, please do so. Make sure you give it a like and a big thumbs up. Um, what? Uh, what was that? Do it real fast. <laughs> Double packaged, so you've got to open it a couple different ways. Yeah. Triple! Alright, well they don't put any uh, protection or anything in there uh, at all. There's no paper or any of that. I thought you said protection. Yeah. So I don't even know what protection is. There's quite a few things in there. I mean, it's uh, it's up to about right here yeah. in the box. So, I mean, I don't know, it looks like some, the box some is underwear and... Uh, a couple of dirty old wrappers and, you know, old dirty bastard and them. Yeah. <laughs> oh. But, uh, you know, if uh, if you're kind of new to the channel, uh, a lot of the things that we try to do here uh, on Scared City is... Make fun of everything. Eh, we make fun of ourselves a lot. Um, but we do a lot of horror-related stuff, whether it be unboxings, us making props, um... And we do have some videos shorts, of us doing you know, tutorials coming up. So I know we haven't done any in a while, but we've also been in the middle of... Uh, we're right now, we're filming a, a movie. So. Yeah. Well, that and the, our major con season that we... Yeah. The ones that we enjoy and the ones that we actually work at. Which, you know, would have been easy for us to set up while we were making some of those things. Yeah. But uh, it was just easier to make them and get them... Because we had a very large amount to do. Yeah. And it's still still going on. Yeah. Unfortunately. Um, first things first, there's a little mystery uh, mini Ooh. plushie. Um, I will not be opening these up today, y'all. I do apologize. Because, uh, again, I don't collect any of this stuff, and I'm planning on just selling it. And uh, a lot of times, stuff sells a little better if it's if it's not been opened. Certain things do. Yeah. Certain things yeah, that sell I mean, if they're opened. I've actually uh, had to open some things because... It was worth more money opening. Oh, yeah. But I don't think this is the case. No, um, I'll yeah. tell you what. Uh, I'll let you go in there and grab one. Grab one. Yeah, grab some. Oh. So, like I say, we're off to a pretty good start. I believe that these actually sell uh, in a lot of places for about... Foxy, Foxy. Five to seven bucks. Foxy, Is that uh, Foxy. got to do with Five Nights? Yep. Yes, that is a Five Nights of Freddy Lanyard. Ooh, and it comes with a little keychain lanyard of Foxy herself. Yep. Plus, you got your little your little badge. Now, these actually come in handy because we've found several of these that we really like that we've bought. 
and we use them when we go to some of these uh, cons that we go yeah. because some of them we do go VIP to, and you have to have your little VIP badges yeah. in these, and the ones that they give you are usually just strangers, more garbage. or less. They're garbage, but we do have our own. Uh, and this is actually really cool because it's got Five Nights at Freddy in black yeah, so you got on one side, and then on the reverse side, it is Foxy. So, yeah, that's actually yeah, and I, pretty I, cool. I apologize. I really don't know a whole lot about the game, so I don't know if I know a little bit about it. What what all of these uh, characters and stuff are, are named? Um, it looks like we have a pin. Super cool. Actually. Um, uh, yeah, yeah, we got a pin. Do you know the character's name on this one? Because I do not. It, it's pretty neat. It's kind of. I tell you, my little girl would tell you in like two seconds of a heartbeat. Yeah. That she draws them freehand constantly. It's a it's a pretty good pretty good pen though. Oh, well, that's kind of what I thought. It is the uh, the purple one, though. The one that looks kind of like a deranged bunny rabbit. Yeah. And at one point, I did know the name of it, but for right now, I couldn't. Yep. So, but yeah. So, still pretty cool. I do a little know, pin topper. I do know that a lot of the lanyard stuff, uh, again, I think that would be like a 5 to $7 value, um, oh, depending, on, depending on where... Where are you getting it at? Yeah, I was gonna say a lot of places like uh, so that's, or Hot Topic, uh, Spencer's, or even uh, what's the uh, um, the Halloween one comes in town all the time. Spirit. Spirit. They're owned by Spencer's, or Spencer owns them. Either way, yeah. uh, I know that those usually go anywhere between twelve, uh, ten and twelve dollars. Okay. At, at the well, price. I'm kind of I'm gonna give the value because this thing says there's a thirty dollar value, so I'm gonna. Give my guesstimate on it mm -hmm. and see if we're we're around that thirty dollar value. Uh, I do know that the pins and stuff like this is a, again another probably five to seven bucks. So I'd say all in all, right now we're at least fifteen dollars, maybe eighteen bucks, maybe a little higher. Um, let me more out of the guys. We got two. Yeah, two. Mm -hmm. Okay. I guess I'll go. Purple guy's name's Lefty. Purple guy's name's Lefty? Yeah. Sure. No, no. Wait a minute. Two purple guys. I don't know. Never mind. Let's see what I got. Collect them all! It's Pokemon, y'all. No. It's Five Nights at Freddy. Pint Size Heroes Five yeah. Nights at Freddy's. So it is... Well, that has a five dollar value because the price yeah, just five dollar value. Uh, I would be guessing it is the little version. It's the whole version of this guy. Well, because the head and there's the whole body with it that's inside of it. So that's pretty cool. That's actually what they call them, pint size, pint heroes. size hero. That's yeah. Oh, maybe. I think it's a little bit smaller than that. What that head is. Well, but that's it's cool. So we're at another five dollar because it actually has a price tag on the back of this yeah. one. So uh, this one's easy to, to get gauge. So right now, I would say for sure we're at twenty dollar value. Uh, and this that's what I think I could sell this stuff for. You know, right now. Oh yeah. Um, there's one more item in here. It's a pretty big item. Uh, this one I believe is for like the things like a Funko Pops. Yeah. Um, yeah, that's exactly what it is. Let's see here. Now that one's lefty. It, I, that's what I thought it was. This is a bear. I don't know. Yeah. From what I was looking at inside the box, it looked like it was purple. Mm -hmm. But that's the one that has the uh, the different colored eye. Yep. So I do know that majority. Of the Funko Pops, even if it is just a plain Jane uh, common, it's is about ten bucks. Eight to ten, usually, yeah. depending on where you're buying it. So, Does it there is. The, the purple guy on the back? No. Well. 
So I am, I, okay. I'm going to go ahead and they, they've got $30 value on the front of it. Uh, I agree with their $30 value uh, assessment. A lot of times when you get these boxes and it says $30 value, uh, it might be $10 value in there. But uh, I feel like that we can we can get probably close to 30 bucks uh, on all this. You know, you gotta pay for shipping and stuff like that. But, oh yeah. Uh, I definitely think we'll end up profiting uh, at least a few dollars uh, mm -hmm. at the yeah. end of the day. So it's not a it's not a bad little uh, not a bad little haul. No, not really. For, uh, for ten bucks. You know, if you uh, feel like the five nights of pretty snow, uh, go check uh, check your local uh, GameStop. That's where I purchased this set. Uh, again, it was uh, right at ten dollars. I think it's pretty good value. Oh yeah. So how many uh, how many items was in it? There was one, two, three, four, five items. So I mean, that's pretty, not bad at all. Pretty good, pretty good value uh, for what it is. Um, I uh, actually probably will end up buying a couple more, uh, but mainly just to, to not all of them to open. Well, I mean that is things that I do because um, I do. We do have an unboxing coming up. Um, should be coming in any day. Uh, they had a fire sale at Bam, and I bought eleven. Oh yeah. 11 boxes so we should Holy have crap we should have you know 20 plus autographs over Jeez. 100 and 100 and something items to look at uh may may be a big video um but it'll be things that we've we've already opened up because I've, I've been buying stuff from bam for a long time but hopefully we do have variants and stuff yeah i mean now that that is a possibility the stuff every, that we didn't get on the boxes that we yeah, got every fire sale so far we have actually got things that i didn't have before so except that's, for the one fire sale where we got one of the exact same thing 15 times no! that was pretty funny <laughs> We literally got like 203, 204, 205, 206, 207, 208, 209, and 2011. Don't know what happened to 210. Yep. Still ain't got no idea on that one. Yep, I don't know what 2011 is, but okay. <laughs> but, uh, you know, we hope you enjoyed it, uh, the video. <laughs> we hope you enjoyed it. I just, I just got it myself. Yeah. Oh, uh, 2010. Uh, hey. Derp. Derp, 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 derp. <laughs> Two o ten, two o eleven. It's been a long day, people. Oh lord, long day. Well, we hope you enjoyed the video. We all, we had a good time uh, in here with the two o eleven. Yeah, the and it's the name of my new band, two o eleven. But uh, <coughs> excuse me. You know, we've got a new uh, PO box. Uh, we'll leave that uh, link down below. Uh, if you'd like to send us anything uh, to unbox, review, uh, you know, anything like that, it's uh, 50, uh, P.O. Box 57. 57? Yeah, 57. P.O. It's... Box 57, Bono, Arkansas. Uh, it is 72416. Uh, also, we'll have the links down below for our uh, merchandise for uh, slaughtery, uh, entrenchment, and for uh, Scared City uh, Productions. Uh, so... It's your earliest convenience, you know. I encourage y'all to check it out to, to take a look at it. Every little bit of it uh, helps support us. Just do it. So we can make uh, make videos for y'all. Um, you know, I do want to say thanks again uh, for watching. Oh yes. Always make sure you hit that uh, like button. And uh, again, you know, this is Scott with Scared City Production, and then we've got Tony. I'm here. He's here. And we'll talk to you later. Bye bye. I know what you think. Does Dean Winchester stand in front of you? Nah, but I'm that sexy. Though. You like what you see? Check out some more stuff.